everyone. In this video, we are going to see how to do a simple 2D inversion using REST2D in file formats. For this, I'm going to check 2D, inverse, and from the file format drop down menu, ResInv file format. Remember, when you hit the import data, you always going to look at the examples folder. Most of examples that we're going to talk about are available in our repository. Go into the parser folder and open res2dinv-dd which is a dipole dipole array file format. If we look at the file we see there is 3 meters lecture spacings 591 measurements in dipole dipole array format. We additionally have topography as a separate list with 61 points at the end of the file. We clearly see that recipe figured the electro spacing as well as topography automatically. We can directly go to the inversion or we can define a mesh and change the inversion settings. For this specific problem, I'm just going to invert the data. Depending on your machine, this can take quite a while and I'm going to pause the video. Well, apparently it was not necessary to pause the video. At the end, you would see that based on the topography, recipe automatically cut out everything below the max DOI and we can estimate the DOI. Clearly, the DOI that recipe decided to put was too shallow. We can go back into the mesh tab and define a fine coarse boundary. I would give it about 25 meters or maybe 30 meters. Create a triangular mesh and reinvert my data. After three iterations, the solution is converged. And as you can see, the DOI makes much more sense now. You can select any color map you like, and also set a maximum and minimum, or plot sensitivity, conductivity, or resistivity in all meter. As you can see, there are clearly two pockets of very conductive anomalies in this cross-section. If you go to the post-processing, a good inversion always have the normalizer between negative 3 and 3 and this one clearly is a good inversion. You can contour this and you can select the sensitivity overlay which shows that the area below this, the estimated DOI, is considered to be not so reliable. Thank you for watching this video.